What looked like a scene from out of a movie was actually these two women's worst nightmare. It was terrifying. It was, uh, it was probably the most afraid I've been in my life. Shabani Balsavar, a film producer, and Shalani Sen, who works in community development, had rented a U-Haul to help move Balsavar into a new house from Hollywood to Los Feliz when they were pulled over by the LAPD. They recall wondering what they had done, parked the U-Haul in front of Balsavar's new home, but looked in their rearview mirror and saw this. At least 10 officers, guns drawn, and a helicopter flying above. I thought I was gonna get shot. I really thought that that was the end. They were ordered to get out of the U-Haul with their hands behind their heads and walk toward the officers backwards. Then they say they were slammed to the ground. I felt his knee in my back and on my neck and push me down into the pavement, push my face down. Um, it was really scary. It wasn't until they were in the back of the police cars, they say they were told by LAPD they had been pulled over because they thought the U-Haul had been stolen. Balsavar told the officer a receipt for the U-Haul that she had rented it earlier that morning was in her purse. And later, the two women were let go. The incident happened February of 2020, but their attorney, Brian Olney, says this never should have happened and has filed a lawsuit against the LAPD. Courts have made very clear but the LAPD refuses to listen. They know what the law is, um, they're sworn to uphold it, but they made a deliberate decision to break it. 